we've got a, 115 acres that we've got from Maui Tropical Plantation. Um, it has water uh, on it, although our first crop, we're not using water. We're, we're doing this first crop uh, dry land, what we call dry land irrigation. So just the natural rain, um, no, no additional uh, irrigation water. We also put on uh, no fertilizer, or actually, I don't know, a little, we tried to fertilize, but it didn't, our fertilizer didn't come out, so it has no fertilizer on it. Uh, no fertilizer, we're not gonna use pesticides, herbicides, it's not actually organic because, you know, it's the land is, you just get out of sugar, so it won't be. But, and we're gonna use compost that may not qualify. We're gonna use things that we can find in the island for nutrients. We're gonna farm it as naturally as we can, and we don't believe we're going to need the, the inputs of chemicals that, um, that, that have traditionally been used here. Um, and we're not doing any GMO, there are no GMO sunflowers. Um, the other crops, we're not gonna do GMO. Uh, we just think there's, it's, we gotta be phono with this. We gotta do, we're trying to do things that are regenerative and, and, and help the land, and it's, it's, it's absolutely possible to do, so let's, let's do it. Um, <laughs> obviously all of our equipment um, is running on biodiesel and so we're not having any petroleum on the property um, and and uh, so and as Kelly said we, we put a few seeds in the ground a little early um, timing wise and you'll get to see those today they're, um, they're doing amazing uh, so so that's what we're doing uh, why are we doing this? Um, you know, it's just been, it's in our DNA for Kelly and I and for our company that, you know, we just want to move move things forward and we, you know, we're, we're, we're not going to, we're not going to wait. We're just going to get out there and try to make, make this happen and yeah. see if we can, we can put a new model on the ground. The great thing about this site is we have some good neighbors, Bobby Pahia and uh, Grant at uh, Kubo Farms. We just, this is a, I'm just excited about this little team of uh, farmers we have here. Um, and thank you, you guys for helping put this all together and getting us on the ground, beating the dirt, um, getting us going forward. You know, so it is about the environment, obviously. It's about economics. We're going to make an actual business out of this, and, and it's and it's about the social impact. So, this is our community. You know, we want to we want to make this a better place. Uh, funding uh, right now, this project um, we you know we we're self funding. So, between Pacific Biodiesel, <laughs> Kelly and I personally, we're 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 going to go out here. And we're going to do it at the pace we can. If we could get more funding, we can go faster. Um, and that funding really at this at this time of this new business, it's really about funding for infrastructure, combines and crushing mills and those pieces, but also um, the research to figure out, you know, we, we we're going to have make some mistakes. Um, we're gonna collaborate with everybody we can. UH Maui College, the state, the county, federal, uh, agriculture departments, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're pretty open. So we look forward to our neighbors. Uh, there's a lot of people that have stepped up and said, hey, I, I got an idea, you know, what, why don't we try this? It's, it's just a beautiful thing. That's what's, that's what's cool about farming here in Hawaii and, and on Maui, our home. 